We're still on Monday, December 10th. In this video, we're going to have some of the different uh, shooting modes of the GoPro 3 of the Hero uh, 3 Black Edition. Um, this has a couple of different uh, optional modes than the other ones do, but uh, I'm just going to go through the basic ones, not really go through all of them. And when, at the end, I'll show you a video of what each one looks like. Fortunately, it's just going to be in the garage, so you're not going to get a whole lot of uh, feature there. But first thing you want to do is turn the GoPro on. I'm just using a little tripod, by the way, the tripod adapter. So then we'll go to our setup mode. The wrench. Okay, see right now, hopefully that's showing up. I'm on 1080 by, with 48 frames per second. Now we can change that, go to the top. You've got the 1080. If we scroll down, we can change our frames per second. We can go 24. 30, 48, or even 60. Now for the sake of the video, to make it short, I'm just going to shoot at 1080, uh, 48 frames per second. So we'll leave that all alone. So there we go. We'll go down to exit. So all right, next, we've got, if you hit the, if you're getting on the top and you hit the button for 1080. So the most common ones, we've got SVGA, which uh, we'll, we'll shoot the first video at the end of the video with that. And then we're going to move to, so I'm, these are going to go in order. So first you'll have SVGA, then we'll do 720, and then we'll do 960, and then we'll do the 1080, and then we'll, lastly we'll do the 1440. Now each of these modes, so if we click on 1440, you've also got the same, well, you know, for the 1440, you've got 24, 30, and 48 frames per second. So let's see what we've got. We'll go down to exit. Let's see what we've got on some of the other ones. So select like that. Let's see. Let's go down to 960. So there we've got that. And we've got, what is that, 800 frames per second? I'm looking through the camera, so it's hard to see. So each one of them's got different modes for the frames per second. We are just gonna use the standard modes. These are all standard right now, what they come default. So it's gonna be a short video. So right now I'm actually gonna to go to uh, the video showing the different modes. We're gonna start with the SVGA, go to the 720, 960, 1080, and 1440. I'm just gonna do four of them in a row real quick. And then uh, that'll do it. So we'll be back in just a minute. Okay, this is the SPGA mode. Just kind of give you an overview of the garage here. It's pretty messy at the moment. Usually I try to keep it a lot cleaner, but I just want to give you an idea of the SPGA mode. There's that one, and we'll come back with 720. Okay, here is 720 mode. Don't know if you can notice any difference with that. There it is. Be nice to get the DT80 out and do some real testing, but again, it's pretty cold out. So anyway, we'll come back with 960. Here is 960. Hopefully you see a difference. If not, then uh, I don't know. There's that. We'll come back with 1080. Here is 1080. And we'll be back with the 1440. Here we are with 1440. I'm going to make this short because it's probably going to take up a ton of space even though it's only a few seconds long. So that is 1440. Again, I don't have the little screen on, so not that that make a difference. I don't know what the difference would be. So, And uh, we'll be right back. Okay, well there you have it. Hopefully uh Gives you a little bit of an idea. I don't know how well it's going to work until after I see the upload myself. So I think an action shot would be much better. So on the motorcycle or something like that would probably give you a better idea. Just like this GoPro Hero 3 really shines uh, in lower light conditions and action shots basically. So, um, you know, th this is not the ideal uh, environment for it but uh, it's all we've got right now so we'll just go with it 
Anyway, that'll do it. If you have any questions or comments, post those below. I'd love to hear uh, other people that get GoPros, how, how you like them. They're the Hero 3. And uh, anyway, please subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.